can leave this front edge or you can blade it over. Looks to have the face pretty square. Very good. Very good indeed. Can, cannot play it any better than what he did. Yeah, very, yeah, ball wasn't sitting too nicely either, so you've got to guarantee you get the ball first, which he did. This does not look like a clean line. 178 yards. It sounded like it was picked cleanly. But well, he's used the driver. Uh, that's yeah. going to be a great shot right there. It's going to be right behind the hole. But uh, three tee shots. He's found a fairway bunker on every mm. tee shot. And gets him to seven. Patrick Reed now just the only man in double digits under par. Billy, I have a question. I know Nicholas used to talk about this, uh, a score in his mind to start the day. Just earlier. Now here's Shoffley looking well left to the target. Yeah, with the ball below your feet, you can put some side spin on it. The slope and contour of the green will help it feed down towards the hole. And Shoffley, a chance to jump to seven under as well here. And does, so they're making birdies here at the sixth. That is the order of the day when you get to this par five. Andrew Shoffley, meanwhile, is uh, climbing the leaderboard. He's at 13. Having a good day, that's for sure, Jim. He's going to use some of the contours to try and get that down to that gully. Of course, Xander just grew up about 10 minutes down the road. One of the lucky ones who can stay at home this week. Network of bunkers on the left side. Downhill putt for Xander Shoffley here. And that one trickling in for birdie. And so Shoffley able to pick up a shot. Um, most players these days will hit a putt. Uh, would hit this shot with a putter. Back in the day when the conditions weren't quite as good and the ball would hop around you, you know, the Raymond Floyds, and I'm not trying to go back to 40, 50 years ago, but just they would pitch the ball. And Shoffley will stay at minus nine. Xander Shoffley at the 15th. Where we are, the flag's down left to center. Uh, oh, nice little hop. We'll even get a bit of slope. Nearly, nearly onto that little ledge on the left side of the green. Trying to be a late charger. We're going on a three under par round. Continuing on some of the great tradition. Now Xander Shoffley, nine under. Working 17. Really needed to make sure that the contact was good there. Here we go, 17. And yes, Jim, Xander Shoffley has this for par. And he leads in scrambling this week. 18 of 23 up and down. <laughs> 